Hey, cat crew. Hope y'all are doing well. We're gonna get our flying car today. Hope you're excited. For anyone, for anybody just wanting to know how to get the car, you have to make sure you're at least level 50 and have completed the main scenario quest, the ultimate weapon. Once you complete the quest line, you can buy the car mount, a hairstyle, six different orchestration rules, as well as a triple triad card. You should also get some cosmetic items as you complete the quest along the way. Also, a reminder, uh, this is a special event from Monday, 13th of September, uh, starting right now at 1 a.m. to Monday, October 18th at 7.59 a.m. PDT. And if you're just looking for the quest, it's at the Steps of Nald in Ulda at coordinates 8.5, 9.7. I'll actually show that to you in a second. And the quest name is The Man in Black. And once the quest line is completed, you should be able to purchase the mount from the Ironworks vendor directly across from the mini cackpot vendor at the Gold Saucer. Um, if it's still the same place, but let's go ahead and get this quest underway because I'm looking super forward to getting my regalia mount I like the idea of a four-seater car and uh, I'm sure as soon as I turn the camera around it's gonna be madness. So let's go have a look Oh, you know what? It's not madness at all. Everybody's completely civilized and hanging out. But yeah, here's the quest It's right next to the steps here uh, If you zoom in right there and let's get it underway. Let's get it. Yeah, it starts by getting gloves. Uh, Kip Jackia has, sent, has caught the scent of a story and needs help chasing it down. This quest is available for a limited time. Let's go. Let's get it. Greetings, adventure. It's been a while. Hmm. Do not tell me you've forgotten about Kip Jackia, reporter for The Raven. You see, a certain rumor has been making its round of late. No few travelers passing, though. Through Thanalan, report seeing an unusual. Wait, what? No few travelers passing through Thanalan report seeing an unusual black vehicle along with peculiar mechanical soldiers. Do you happen to know anything about them? Uh, no. No? Let me tell you then that there is a growing concern that they might be some unknown type of Garlean weaponry. Why? Even the good people of Gar Garland Ironworks have been called upon to investigate. This promises to be a most compelling story, and I intend to be the first reporter to tell it. But in order to do that, I require the contribution of good folks such as yourself. Lest you wonder, the black vehicle was most recently sighted near Blackbrush in central Thanalan. Should you come into any information, I ask that you bring me word without delay. Oh, well, that's actually, I love that. That's really dope. Right, let's do this. Let's do this! Okay, investigate. So we're gonna teleport over here to Blackbrush. This is actually really exciting. Like, I don't know, I've, I just started playing this game a little while ago, and um, I saw that mount the first day, especially when it flies, and it just looks amazing. So I'm like really hyped for it. All right, and then we want to head down this way. You know, I noticed that uh, a lot of Lollafells aren't uh, culinarians, but then I realized why. The stakes are too high. I'm assuming this is where I need to go because of all the people. Um, looks, no, can't click on anything because everyone is so nice. Uh, no, I don't want to examine. This is going to be so great. I have one of that. So far, we're off to a good start. Maybe I can hear. Hold on. Let me dismount and see if I can. I've squeezed my way. Wait, where is it? It should be around here somewhere, right? Just gotta find it. Aha, here we go. I don't ask me how that worked. Just feel free to use it. If you get stuck in a situation like that when you're trying to get your super epic car mount. You're looking around. Mm hmm It's dirt. Gah, why won't you move, damn it? There it is! Oh, that's the car. Oh, it looks so... Oh. Oh. Hey, there's my man. The man in black. Hey, buddy. What's going on? You, you car broken? You having some trouble? Hey, do you know if there's a garage nearby? I don't even know what a garage is. 
Just my luck, to have a breakdown in the middle of nowhere. What is this place, anyway? Uh, yeah, this is a desert. Thanalan? Orzia? That's on no map I've ever seen. I'm not sure how I got here, and I've got no idea where I need to go, but I'm going nowhere at this rate. Isn't there anyone around here who can fix cars? I don't even know what a car is. Uh, I do trust Sid, but Garland Ironworks, because that way we can help Kit. Seriously? Man, what a relief. Anyway, might as well keep pushing her along. Yeah, so there is grass in your car. Hey, mind giving me a hand? She's heavier than she looks. What's your name, by the way? Catalina Loaf, my dude. Appreciate the help, Catalina. My name's Noctis, but you can call me Noct. Alright. And now that we're introduced, let's put our backs into it. <sighs> Talk about deja vu. Unbelievable. And now we push the car. Hey, do you guys know what Moogles use when they go shopping for groceries? Coupons. <laughs> uh, that's terrible. Oh, ho, if it isn't Mistress Catalina. Yeah, Mr. Iron Hands. Come help us out, buddy. Whoa, sick ride! By the god, she's magnificent! Such elegance, such refinement! I mean, yeah. Absolutely. Ah, as you may have heard, we were tasked by the Alliance with investigating the mystery vehicle. Well, here it is. I'm glad I could bring it to you. Isn't this spectacular? Master Sid himself should be close. If you'll excuse me a moment, I will direct him hither. Alright, you go hither him up. You know, Sid's a good guy. Let's get that. Catalina, why I'm not surprised that you're here already. Fake British accent. Pip pip cheerio. Fixing cars. So this is the machine. At a glance, it doesn't appear to be of Garlean make. The young fellow there, I take it he's the owner? Uh, yeah. I found him in the desert. And Noctis doesn't seem to know anything about Eorzea, you say. Peculiar. Might he have, the la might he have lost his memories like I did? Hey, I'm right here, you know. Now, if you're done talking about me, you're Sid, right? Not quite the Sid I was expecting, but if you can fix the Regalia, then it's all good. I will be honest with you. This technology I am unfamiliar with. I can't make any promises, but I will try my best. Appreciate it. There's uh, just one little problem. I don't have any money. Never you mind that. To be able to work on a unique machine such as this is its own reward. Well, you looked out, Noct. Seriously, you're a lifesaver. Oh, and Catalina, I trust you also heard about the mechanical soldiers? Yeah. We're tasked with investigating them as well. By all accounts, they appear to be simply men, albeit armored head to toe and bearing advanced firearms. What betrays them is the unnatural efficiency with which they move. Sound like MTs to me. EMTs? Magic Troop. Magitech Troopers. Robotic soldiers created by Niflum Empire. Come to think of it, the last thing I remember is being at a Nif base. It's kind of hazy, but there was a strange machine, and before I knew it, I was here, in this place called Orzia. That's quite an unusual tale, but then again, I'm in the presence of unusual technology. I have no reason to doubt your words. You may have an inadvertently activated a teleportation device and been sent to our world. 
At any rate, you seem to be acquainted with these mechanical soldiers. Perhaps you could investigate in our stead? They were most recently sighted near the unholy air, not far to the east of here. Hmm, if they're really MTs, they might hold some clue on how to return home. Alright, leave them to me. Wait! Yeah, like, buddy, you can't just... I mean, you're in a desert, you don't know where you're going, I... You know what? I'll go find him. It wouldn't do to leave our visitor to wander a strange land alone. Could you accompany him, Catalina? Rest assured, I'll tend to the regalia in the meantime. You got it, bud. I'm off. I'm out of here, and I also ex fully expect to see, like, 500 people all doing this at the same time. Oh, my cats are fighting. Yay. Yeah, so... That's, yeah, that's exactly what's happening here. Alright, let's go. Let's get it. Let's get it. Where do we go? Where do we go? Where do we go? Okay, we go here. On my pretty horse. Whee. I found out what you call uh, Lollafells that are guys, by the way. Apparently it is Lollafella. <laughs> Okay, so everyone and their grandma is over here waiting for this fate. Man, I love events like this because people just get so amped and, like, go crazy with it. They got everything. And I don't know, it's it's just an exciting thing to have, like, a giant group of people. I highly, strong, I highly advise that if you are doing this quest, like, just enjoy what it is. Like, I don't know, if you watch obviously the whole thing, this whole video, you already know what the quest has in store, but try to just enjoy it in your own unique, like, experience, because I, I certainly do, I think it's great. I also want this card now, if you don't know, you gotta get a bunch of triple triad cards for it, well, that's, you know, another video another time. Yeah, this is the, I think this is the hardest part, waiting for the actual fate to happen. Oh, somebody's cruising by in their own little car mount. Here, I'll get up just to, just to get into the crowd, you know. Might as well, here, we'll, we'll, oh, we'll, we'll have that tree block everything so that nothing can be seen. It's very good. Um, I'll just do a little cheer. And just wait. Wear faith. Probably broken because of all the people in the zone. You can feel the energy people are about to start throwing bonkers here. I thought this would be a little bit quicker. But it's okay. Because we can wait a few minutes. Because we're going to get a car! Oh no, everybody, oh no, everybody's getting on their big mounts. This is, this is how it all starts. I've seen this before. Participate in the fate. Oh wait, is that it? Oh, that's gotta be, that's gotta be it, right? That just appeared? Everybody running over? Oh, that has got to be it. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, everybody run back now. Everybody run back. Let us sink. Let us sink to level 8. And now, if I can, I am going to just... We're just going to do anything we can to try to dish out damage to participate in this fate. Oh, that is a big robot. What? Okay. 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 Don't want to get hit by it. Okay, that's really cool, actually. Man, that thing is a lot of help, too. Okay, okay, okay. okay I'm done being uh, struck by the MA-X. Oh, yeah. Got him. It explodes. Okay, complete. Let's get out of here. And we're going to go wait at the designated location. Noctis is like, that's all she wrote. I mean, it's a... Okay, 
Now we're gonna wait at the designated location with the other 90 people that are here. Um, it'll be great, fantastic. Just waiting, you know, waiting for my new friend. I hope he didn't leave. Hey, there you are, knocked. What's up, buddy? Nice uh, destroying those robots. Hey, hey. MTs, just as I thought, and a, and a Magic Tech armor to boot. They must have crossed over when I did. But I couldn't find any clues on how I might cross back. Gah, what am I supposed to do now? Well, uh, let's consult... Ah, oh, see, this is a tough choice for me. I'm gonna go with let's consult Kip. No, 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 no. You know what? Let's, let's consult Sid. Let's talk to Sid, my boy, and see what he says. That's what I'm saying right now, see? Sid. That old geezer? Well, he did seem to know his stuff. That is a super rude way to address someone who is fixing your car for free. But that is completely knocked, so... You're coming along, right? Let's go check in on the regalia. Yeah, sounds good to me, man. Let's do it. I think he has a crush on me. Oh, I found out uh, what Astrologian's favorite sweaters are the other day. They're cardigans. <laughs> okay, let's see. Oh, I can I can already hear everybody. I just oh wow, man, they are quick to that. I am definitely not the fastest boy in the club here. All right, let's go. Let's get on it. I'm so happy these quests don't have people just like running all over the place when they're in the quest. So, how fared you? Were you able to find the mechanical soldiers? Yeah, and we kind of beat them up. You fought them, so the rumors were true. That being the case, I would very much like to examine the technology with my own eyes. Yeah, yeah. I have a favor to ask, Catalina. The next time you encounter these soldiers, could you salvage their parts? Sure. Ahem. Mistress Catalina, may I ask that you bring said parts to either myself or my colleagues in the three city-states? Oh, that was... yeah. Whoa. We will pass them along to the chief after he has completed his long list of outstanding tasks. It's hard being the boss. Ain't that right, Sid? Alright, alright, let's get this going. Hey, Nock, how you going? Where have you been? Hey, where's my car? Uh... Don't worry, she's in a safe place. A reporter came sniffing about while you were away, so I decided to move her to the dispatch yard that we might carry out the repairs undisturbed. I'm pleased to say I was able to identify the problem, and I believe it can be fixed. However, it may take some time to fashion the replacement part. I see, that's good to know. <gasps> you must be the mystery man! It's Kip. Oh, I'm no fashion correspondent, but I like your look, a simple silhouette with an emphasis on the details. What's the deal with you? Ah, where are my manners? Kipif Jackia, reporter for the Raven at your service. You are the owner of the mysterious black vehicle, yes? Uh, yeah, I don't know what to tell her, man. What, you mean the regalia? The reg... I beg your pardon? Regalia. Ah, so that's what she's called. A stately name. She's like nothing anyone has ever seen in Orzia. May I ask where you hail from, and how you came here to be here? I'm from far away. I was on a journey, we were fighting, then suddenly I was here. I really need to find my way back. There's so much I have to do. A mysterious young man, come from another world, desperately seeking a way home. A promising premise. Now then, may I ask what manner of journey you are on? No. It's personal. While I was traveling with my friends, we were on our way to meet someone important to me. Someone important to you? 
Could you please elaborate on the nature of your relationship with this individual? Hold on a, just a second. You're not the only one with questions, you know. I've got loads of my own. Well, sir, the Raven has many eyes and ears, and I would be happy to call upon them all for the answers you seek, if you'll agree to grant me an exclusive interview. Yeah, sure. Whatever. Then it's settled. If you would accompany me to Ulda, we may continue our conversation while I put my connections to work. Well, I guess since the car's not going anywhere for a little while, it couldn't hurt. Which means I am going back, back to Ulda, Ulda. Oh, the excitement still hasn't worn off for me. I'm so pumped to get this car. I cannot wait, like, to take my wife around and just, like, looking, cruising in style, being that guy, you know, black car, get some black glamour going on, and uh, just, like, looking fly. I'll have to, since I'm a monk, I'll have to play the song Grease Lightning while I drive around in my car. But y'all are, you know, familiar with that at all. All right, let's here usually one of the benefits of being like the first people to do these quests uh because I, I wait for it to come open is that there aren't that many people around but there are so many people doing this one it is crazy i feel like uh, everyone in my grandma is trying to get this car i've already put the word out to my colleagues and i expect to hear back from them any moment now perfect ah speak of the devil yeah skip it here what do you have for me Sorry to skip that over. Truly, thank you so much. I'm just like so excited. About it. I am uber, uber pumped. See, what did I tell you? We have a hopeful lead. We'll need to take a little trip together, the three of us. See to your preparations and let me know when you're ready to depart. I got gloves. I'll probably make it one day. The fate, like clockwork, will appear at the clutch in central Thanalan over the course of the seasonal event. Completing this fate will reward players with pieces of identified Magitek. These items may be exchanged for various goods by speaking with an Ironworks hand. Ironworks hands are posted to Blackbrush and in each of the three city-states. Nice. But oh, now we get pants. Kip Jacka is eager to set out with you and Noctis. Ready to depart? Excellent! Our destination is the Twelves Wood. More of those mechanical soldiers have been sighted there. To be sure, my colleague only heard the rumors. I suggest first heading to Gridania and seeking out the witnesses. Sounds good. Let's get going. Nice. Ah, why? Wait. New as you are to Eorzea, you may struggle to find your way around. Permit me to show you to Gridania. Alrighty. Lead the way. Chat is going crazy. All right, let's go to Gridania. It's the Gridaniest ya in the world. Why did I click that? Okay. This is ah, oh gosh. The one of my big things about this is like the event always takes a little bit of time, and I just. I'm so impatient with it. Like, that's. I, I normally don't click through quest stuff, but, like, oh man, I'm ready. I am so ready. I'm sure you are too. Let's go. Break down, break down. Du, du, du. I'll race you. I'll race you. I win. Cross the finish line first. Down to Old Gridania. We're talking about Old Gridania. Not the new Gridania. Alright, let's go, let's go. Do, 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 do. Hadre 4. My apologies. Mechanical soldiers, my apologies, but I'm not familiar with the rumors. Well, I am. Fellow I know claims he came upon near them the Hawthorne Hut in the East Shroud. At first we thought they were men, but on closer inspection he says they were more like dolls. And you didn't think to share this little tidbit with me, brother? If I were to fall victim to these abominations, I shall consider my death on your head. 
Y'all should talk more. Well, anyway. I'm gonna go find the next lady, which is next to the Lancer's Guild. Or next person, I don't know. Oh wait, I can just run straight up, can't I? This is another thing I'm really bad at. Navigating! I could probably just do whatever, but whatever! Okay, here we go. Gridonia is a really pretty state. Or city state. City. City slash state. Tell me, did you see the doll men? Mechanical soldiers. As a matter of fact, one of our sentries at Emmer 6 Spire reported encountering them while patrolling the Bramble Patch. At first, he took them to be scarecrows, but as he approached them, they suddenly sprang to life and set upon him. We suspect that they are some heretofore unknown imperial weapon, and we are deliberating a response even as we speak. If your path takes you near that, that area, you would do well to exercise all caution. You telling me, the warrior of light, to exercise caution? That's very considerate of you. Thank you for wondering about my well-being. We're gonna teleport because I'm lazy, and it's gonna take 500 years to load into that because of how I am as a person. Hmm. Hey, did you guys hear what the Lala fell said when I asked him for a little bit of gill? He said, sorry, I'm a little short. Ha! Got him. Alright, let's keep going. I'm gonna go over here. That guy's just floating around. This guy's looking cool. He's got a cape. Right, I'll race you. Race you. Come on. Come on. Can't beat me. Can't beat me. Can't beat me. I'm too fast for you. Oh no, I'm not fast enough. Oh, he took me. Oh, he overtook it. He won. Oh no. Heard about the mechanical soldiers, have you? Indeed, they have been sighted in the East Shroud. While I do not personally know the details, the Wood Whalers are in the state of a heightened vigilance throughout the Twelves Wood. Neat. Alright, where am I reporting to Kiff? We gotta go back. All this way. Okay, where are you next to? I mean, he doesn't have a beater. We're gonna go over here. Wait. Definitely don't need that. Okay. Let's go. Here, where am I? I'm not there. Why is it? Alright. Well. Whatever. I'm sure there are quicker ways to do this, but I am all about that scenic route and going to a teleport. There we go. We are on our way. <laughs> all right. Let's get it. Reporter, reporter, I have something to tell you. So, were you able to learn anything about the mechanical soldiers? Just that they're mechanical. Mm, I'll say a man saw them at the Hawthorne Hut. I see, in that case, if we were to keep watch of the Bramble Patch, we should be able to find them eventually. Well then, what are we waiting for? Yeah, probably not imminent death. Wait, just a... Please hurry, after Noctis, the Twelves Wood can be a veritable maze, even for the locals, and I wouldn't do if he were to lose his way. He seems like a capable sword, I believe in him. I'm gonna wait at the designated spot again. Because Noctis cannot wait for us. Go get it. Let's get down to flying through the woods on my magic bird. Doo -doo -doo. Probably gonna be more. I hope there's not more people like just being all over the place with this thing again. Uh, 
Is it here? It is here! So the further you get through the quest line, the easier it is to find everything. Yes, I am prepared. My body is ready. Give me car. I'm out in the middle of the woods. This bramble patch sure looks nice. And pointy, like my ears. Hmm. This, this the area, is it? Yeah, man. That's what I said. No luck so far. Guess we play the waiting game. Yeah. Oh yeah, nighttime stargazing in the bramble patch. I'm just looking around like, yeah, I don't see any, uh, what'd you call them, magic tech soldiers? I don't see them. You guys got good food over there where in your planet? Oh, what was that noise? There was a noise. You hear that? Come on, let's check it out. Okay. Whee! Oh wow, what? That wasn't a very far check out. That was... What the? That's a demon! Oh. Is that... Is that not... A, is that something from your world? That thing's dangerous. We can't leave it running around. Let's smash it. Bash it. Crash it. Heh, <laughs> you're up for it too, eh? Come on then, let's do it. Absolutely. Put me in, coach. Just let me beat it up. Oh yeah, oh yeah, here we go, here we go. I say we have one. I have no idea how to do how to say that. Okay, we got a whole pizza pie. Oh my goodness, I hope. Oh, I gotta get out of here. I, couldn't. I didn't see the thing over there. But that's okay. Oh, Mama Mia, Death Rays. Nobody wants to deal with Death Rays. They make you unalive. I am unsure. They knock us really out there. Knocking like this. So, ha ha. Like, 10 out of 10 jokes for me. Oh, someone's here. So this is like, I mean, this is definitely harder than the fate was, um, but it still doesn't seem like it's overly difficult for anything. Uh, I'll tell. I'll go take care of the pillar, man. If you don't like the look of it, I'll go. I okay. I, I did it. Ow. Okay. Can we do what? All right, all right, all right. One more than I expected. I'm happy that, you know, super cool me. This time, I've got to be able to do something. Surely I have to be able to... Right, but can I hit it? How do I do the thing? What am I doing? What? What? So I think I did the right thing? I'm not sure. I didn't die, so... You know, already a positive there. Um, let's go further into that. Monsignor has his death ray. This looks really cool. Oh no, my friend spotted it before. Oh, that's gonna hurt. That's gonna hurt so much. And it did. Wow, that must be a wizard. 
got your back, buddy. Thick and thin, we'll always have each other's back. Got him. All right. Nothing to it. Nothing to it. Got him. So this will get me pants. I get pants for this. It's all I want. Well, that in a car. I want pants in a car. Is that such an unreasonable request? Maybe. That woman needs pants. It's got the shadows of death. First Magitech Troopers, now a daemon. What the hell's going on? Not cool, bro. Not cool. Uh, all that fighting made me hungry. All that fighting made me hungry. Hmm, I too am hungry. Now that you mention it, I'm pretty hungry too. Let's go eat. Right, let's set up camp. We can have our traditional food, jelly donuts. It has been like a whole day in the bramble patch. Been a whole day in the brambles. Got a nice little campsite. It looks so cozy. That looks so nice. That is spectacular. Oh my god, it is jelly donuts! Look at him. So jelly and donut like. And if you don't get that reference, I'm sorry already. So, what's your story? Why do you go around doing what you do? Pays the bills. You know, started off just needing money. Uh, ended up, you know, being that guy. Protecting those dear to me. Protecting, huh? You and Gladio would get along, I bet. The big guy's always ready to throw himself into harm's way for us. We were traveling together, me and him and a couple of others. Hearing your story, I couldn't help but be reminded of them. Well, what... My purpose? That's a tough one. I guess you could say it's keeping a promise. But I can't do that while I'm here. I have to get back to my own world. And defeat the Heartless. <laughs> that chair looks so comfortable. Somehow. You can really set the mood in Final Fantasy. Unfortunately, I ruin it every time, but they are good at it. Dark of Night, objective fulfilled. Let's get it. Every second, every moment, I can feel myself getting closer and closer to the Regalia. It calls to me, says Catalina, drive me. And I respond by being like, yeah, okay, yeah, sure. That's fine. That sounds good. 
Cool. It's like a forest leader mount. Mm. Alright, let's do it. So, how did you fare? Were you able to find your answers? Nope. No, we found only more questions. Like, how the hell a Damon ended up here as well? Uh, Damon? It's a kind of monster. From your world, I assume. And it somehow came to be here in Orzia. I'm no naturalist, but I imagine it being similar to a void scent. And if even a monster such as that could find its way to our world, then surely, surely you can find your way back too. Yeah, I hope so. I'll keep working with my colleagues to find new leads. Just sit tight for now. Actually, I'd rather go for a walk. Check out the area a little. That's cool, yeah? Well, it should be safe enough if you keep close to the city. Great. See you later. Ah, oh, wait! Just a... Eddie's gone. There he goes again. Though I do not think that Noctis would disappear on us, I would feel much better knowing you were with him. Will you go and keep him company? I promise to have new information to share before long, so see that you both return soon, alright? Yeah, yeah, totally. Mm hmm That's what I'll do. Speaking with the old Noctis boy. Let's go. Let's go. Oh man. I'm so ready. I don't even know. I don't know how long this is gonna take. The last few quests for like events have only taken like uh like about forty minutes, but it's been about forty minutes. And I'm like alright. When when do get car please? Uh but don't wanna rush it too much, wanna enjoy the story, wanna enjoy the atmosphere. But I want my car. Oh, hey, what's up? Uh, you know, just hanging out. I want to hang out with you. You're cool. You got nice eyes. I mean, you got... Yeah, you're, you're cool. But anyway, what about you? You want to hang out? Well, you can tell Kip she doesn't need to worry. I can take care of myself, and I'm not about to run off somewhere. I was just checking out the closing at this stall here, and as I was browsing, the shopkeeper offered me some stuff for free. Your friend has a fine physique and exceptional fashion sense. Having an attractive young man such as him model our garments is the best form of advertisement. Thanks, lady. Anyway, I want to explore some more. You're cool to hang out for a bit, yeah? Oh my god, he's asking me to hang out. That's so great. I hope my wife doesn't get jealous. Ooh, okay, double. Noctis feels the need to unwind. After all that, I still don't have any idea how I'm supposed to get home. For now, it looks like there's nothing I can do except wait for Kif to dig up clues. So I was thinking, I've come all this way to this beautiful place. I might as well try to see what I can of it, so I've got something to tell my friends. It may not look like it, but I'm kind of crazy about fishing. I go whenever I have time, and I've got time now, so I'm going to hit up a place nearby. You should come too. Okay. Yeah, pretty, pretty man. I'll go fishing with you. Oh, I'm not a, I don't have the fishing job, but I'll go, I'll watch you fish. That sounds cool. That sounds super cool to me, yo. Alright, let's fly over there. And then let's do this. Wait, is that that is it? Okay. <laughs> Those aren't fish. Those are scorpions. Let's see. He said fish, so I assumed it would be close to the river. But it doesn't look close to a river. And I don't see a group of people standing anywhere. That's a squirrel. Let's see here. Oh, there we go. Just look for the people if you're ever lost. That's a pretty cool rod, man. You gonna show me how to work that? How to work that? What took you so long? I've already reeled in a dozen. <laughs> I'm slow. 
to be honest with you. I'm worried. I keep thinking, what if I never found my way back? And it gets me down. But being here in this tranquil forest and casting the line, it calms me, helps me focus. I have to get back. People are counting on me. Ah, oh, buddy. And I'm counting on you. A terrible choice, really. I am the worst. Oh, hey, let's take a photo together. That massive water wheel over there would make for a great backdrop. Sure. I don't know what a photo is, but... Great. You ready? Here we go. I'm totally printing screen on this. Nice. I can practically hear Prompto say, Love the lighting. Can't wait to show this to the fellows when I get back. You're right. We should be getting back ourselves. Come on, let's go. Speak with old kip a dip a dip Just like every quest, it is teleporting back and forth quite a few times. As is the way Heidelin designed it. Praise be to her name, Mughalmog the Twelfth. Best Mughalmog king of them all, godlyhood god. Oh, you guys know what type of uh, shoes white mages wear? Heels. <laughs> oh, so many puns. This video, I'm definitely going to get some flack about it, but that's okay. I don't mind. Oh, why did that need to open? That didn't need to open at all. You can see how bad I am at crafting. After the car. After the car. Oh, man, I want this car. I want this car. I don't care how long it takes me. It'll take all year. It'll take a summer. And you do have a pretty long time. From September 13th to October 18th is actually a really long time to get all this. But I guess that makes sense because you need to get... Like, if you don't have 230k MGP, you can't buy everything that the, the vendor offers. But if you do already, then not that bad. Catalina Noctis, thank the gods you're back. What's the matter? I've just learned from a colleague that the mechanical soldiers have also appeared in Ixtali territory. Ixtali? Whatever. That in itself wouldn't be a cause for concern, but the beastmen responded with alarm to the trespassers and have summoned forth Garuda. Uh, that bird lady? Pretty sure we already took care of her, back in my world anyway. Gasp! What? You mean to say you're a pri primal slayer like Catalina? Primal? Is that like an astral or a messenger? Well, whatever it is, we'll take care of it one way or another. So, where's Garuda supposed to have appeared exactly? At the Howling Eye, her domain to the north, but it's nigh impossible to venture near. For Garuda shouts her sanctuary with violent winds. If you are determined to face her, however, I will contact the Ironworks and request a loan of an airship. Let's do it. Let's break this thing. We got this. Put it on my bill. Very well then. While you see to your preparations, I will secure your transportation. When you're ready, come and meet me in the front of the Caroline Canopy. Caroline? Caroline? You've proven yourself a friend. If we're gonna face Gruda together, I'll lend you the power of kings. I'm already down. Let's get it. It's a special power that I have, but I can share it with others. With it, you can quickly warp around like you've seen me do. It might take some getting used to, but I'm sure you've got what it takes. Guru is causing trouble because of the MTs, and I feel responsible for bringing them here. Let's go make things right. Yeah. 
Yeah, let's do that. A little bit of loading in my life. Way too much loading in my life. Please, no more loading. Okay. We... Alright, and then we gotta speak to Kiff again, who is... Why are they always... Just stay on that side of town. Why is it so hard? And if y'all have stuck with it this far, I thank you so much, because this is like an hour of stuff going on. I did not expect a full hour, but like, I'm actually pretty pi like hype about it still. Uh, I, I just want that car so bad, man. It is so cool. I saw it on the first day. Uh, I started playing like I think a lot of people did. And it is just amazing. It's such a cool mount. And I'm so happy they didn't put it into the Mog Station. Which they might after this. So if you haven't, you know, if you uh, just started playing like I did, go as quick as you can to get it. Never know. Noctis is here. All these people are here. What do I? Am I clicking on something? Okay. The airship is ready to bear you and Noctis into battle. Are your preparations in order? Yeah, sure. You know, but without further ado, then. I was hoping I could get to stay level 72 when I went and fought her, but you know, whatever. I'm gonna go beat up a bird with boobs. Walk, run, run for your lives! Look like our goddess. It is yet our goddess. It is not. Nay, something else. That thing is. Flee this place. We must. <coughs> Flee! What? Whoa, that thing is like the root of plus. That thing looks crazy. What? That is a mantis Gerudo. That is so cool. That's lit. Clamorous creatures, why have they summoned me? And what strange land is this? Gerudo like being. Ah, the chosen king, Noctis. So that is the way of it. Yours was the presence that drew me hither. Very well, take up your weapon, Chosen King, and face me. We shall see if you are worthy of my power. Are we worthy? We'll slap you up bang. physical attack. Use the duty action warp strike to attack Rita from the distance. So I can just... Oh, that's pretty... Like, that's... Okay. That's awesome. That is probably one of the most awesome things ever. Okay, okay, okay. And then I just... The warp strike. I've made error. I have made an error. Non error. It's a link strike. I don't know. Throw a warp strike together to trigger a link strike and deal more damage. Okay, you can target this rock, zap over, and then once it back, okay, that makes it work. I'm like running. Do me a 
favor and just die for you. Not that I have like any hate towards you, but I really need that car. But I will kill an endangered species for it. Let's get him, Noctis. Let's run away, Noctis. Let's get him again, Noctis. Take me like 500 years, but I'll do it. I will beat this bird. Ah, okay, that's not good. It's slow. Keep warping? Is that what this is? I'll do it. I'll do it a hundred times. Okay. We good? Are we good now? Are you done throwing your little fit? I have no idea what that is. It was like the first one to that marker. Save me. Don't do it. Active timing it. What is this? Uh, click, click the wind. Click. Oh, kill her. Do it, my guy. Destroy her. Okay. That was lit. All right. Get him. No health. Like one HP. We got him. Good on it. That was actually stressful. Like, I don't know if it was, but like it made me feel stressed out. You pack a serious punch, Catalina. I'm impressed. Why, thank you. I punch monsters all the time.
Yeah, the crystal has chosen well indeed. I acknowledge your strength, Noctis. Yours and your companions both. Man, what is it with gods and trials? You always have to be so skeptical. So it is decreed, at the world's peril, do we grant our power unto the untested. Huh. Never thought of it like that. Oh my gosh, it's my car! Sweet ride. Apologies for the delay. But she's unlike anything I've seen before, so it took me a while to get acquainted. But the regalia is as good as new. Seriously? I owe you big time. Noctis, there is much you have left undone on Yoss. Your presence here is an anchor allowing me to link the two worlds for you. I shall open the way. Well, Noctis, it looks like you get to go home with crazy scary bird person. Tarry not, for the gate cannot remain for long. Got it. Thanks. Divinities, one minute they're trying to kill you, the next they're helping you. I'll never understand them. Thanks for the company, Catalina. It was nice going around with you. Yeah, thanks for the clothes. I had fun. Let's do it again sometime. Yeah, definitely. We gotta hang out again. Well, I better get moving. I've got a promise to keep after all. Take care now. It's like we knew each other for a lifetime, bro. Then drive off into the sunset. We're into that portal. Later, man. Whoa. He's gonna hit that person with his car if he goes through there. Look out, beep beep. And just like that, he was gone. He didn't even give me his number. Ghosted again. Right, so does this mean like I get so I can go buy the car now, right? Right? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I'm so impatient with this. This is the most impatient I've ever been with anything in this game so far. I'm sure there's a lot more, but like this is the biggest one I've had so far. Oh, I can't wait. This is good, this is good stuff. Somebody did a backflip. Burr, burr, burr. It's cold. Before Noctis went to the portal, I could have sworn I saw a woman amidst the light, an ethereal beauty dressed in all white. Yeah, I saw that too. It was weird. I saw her too. It seemed to me she was waiting for Noctis, guiding him. I can only assume they share a deep bond. Oh, then perhaps that was his fiance. I have no idea. Perhaps so, and perhaps not. The sole person who could have enlightened us has vanished into the light. It's gonna be hard to write a story. Well, whoever and wherever Noctis' fiancé may be, I do hope they are reunited. That's like, yeah. I mean, yeah. Everybody look up at the raining sky. Right, well, events are still fresh in my mind. I shall return to my office and put pen to parchment. Master said, many thanks for your cooperation. Yeah. Yeah. But the most of all, thanks... Most thanks of all, I reserve for you, my dear adventurer. In no small part due to your help, Noctis managed to find his way home, and my article can reach a climactic conclusion. 
See that you do not miss it. You. Yeah. Once I learn how to read, I will totally read the paper. A strangely charismatic young man was not. In the end, we never learned the circumstances of his coming here. But if he has things he must do back home, as that Garuda-like being said, perhaps this was a trial that he had to overcome along his journey. At any rate, old friend, I believe our work here is done. Wherever the long road may lead, may not just ever ride in the light of the crystal. Where? Where do I buy my car? Let's go. Do, do, do. And now I look back dramatically. Wow, not this. I hope you're doing good, buddy. Oh yeah, give me a jacket, give me some boots. Quest complete. You can now exchange MGP for special items by speaking with the Ironworks vendor at the Gold Saucer, available for a limited time only. Let's go, brother from another mother crystal. Brother, 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 brother. Okay, let's. I'm extra hype about this. So now you go to the gold saucer after completing that, completing, completing that quest line that we just went through together. Boy, what a ride! Haha, <laughs> no pun intended on that one, but it happened. So you just, we're gonna have to live with it. Okay, 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 okay. Excitement, it's kind of bubbling up. I'm gonna buy everything. I've been preparing for this moment. I made a video preparing for this moment. Um, I hope you watched it to prepare for this moment, so you knew a few days ahead instead of like you know just getting thrown into the mix because you need two hundred thousand MGP for this. I guarantee you, everyone and their grandma is gonna be at the gold saucer right now trying to buy this stuff. Uh, I'm gonna pop my knuckle, and nothing came out. Let's try the other one. All right, that one did good. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay, uh, ironworks, which means it should be here. Which means, yes, there it is, okay. This is where it should be. Mini Catpot goes down over here. Everybody's at him. We're gonna buy, yes, yes, okay, yes, that's awesome. We're gonna get some Lucian Locks. We're gonna buy the thing, and I think, I thought there was no orchestration rolls. Not a problem. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter, doesn't matter. Pay no attention to my horrible, horrible uh, inventory here. Got the regalia. Okay, okay, okay. Now we gotta we gotta go multi seat mounts. See, I've never had one before. Isn't that awesome? Uh, okay, I'm like actually like I'm not like shaking, but I'm like like I'm almost there. Um, my brain is just going crazy. Multi seat mount guide. Where is car? Oh, there is car. All right, now we gotta go to somewhere we can drive this thing. Let's go here. I know I can drive it here. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm so ready. I'm so ready. I'm so ready. And that, that's how you get the mount for anybody uh, that's interested in, you know, getting the mount. I, I'm pretty sure a large majority of the player bases would be pretty interested in that. Well, let's test this out. Oh, this is it. Yes! Deja vu! I've just been in this place before. Higher on the streets and I know it's my time to go. Okay. And for the best part, the takeoff is incredible. Look at that. Alright. That is the money right there. Ladies and gentlemen, that is the money. I. Oh, this car is so cool. This is such a cool mount. Oh, thank you so much to Square Enix, the Final Fantasy team, everybody. Like, oh, that's amazing. I cannot wait for everything to give rides, to do all sorts of stuff with this mount. Let's take a picture of that. Um, well, folks, there you have it. You and I can now cruise in Orzia in style and even take three people with us. If you have any interest in me covering different things, please let me know in the comments. I would be happy to branch out from events and just showcase different things in Final Fantasy XIV. Um, but, you know, don't have that many ideas. Uh, not heavily editing things now, as you can clearly see from the hour and however long uh, video that was just posted here. Uh, but I would be happy to make anything for Final Fantasy XIV. 
Also, if you've made it this far in the video, please consider subscribing. It may not be like a big thing to you, but for me, it's gonna help me get a lot of traction and go through some stuff and like maybe actually can start doing editing and some other stuff later, but I have to grow before I can, you know, really put everything into it. Um, I'm hoping to make more videos just to showcase the fun and joy to be had in Final Fantasy, and I would love it to, you know, create a community and, you know, help out and do things like that. But I hope to see y'all soon, you know, come back to the channel, come by, check out any new videos. Other than that, have a great day, evening or night, and most of all, have fun driving and flying this beast mount around. You earned it. Thank y'all so much and have a good one.